Hello, welcome to HelpYourMath.com. My name's Henry, and today we're going to continue with equations of lines. Now, we're going to be given two points on the line, and we have to find the equation in slope-intercept form, y equals mx plus b, where m is the slope and b is the y-intercept. So suppose we're given the two points, 2 comma 5, and 6 comma 13. I'm just going to denote these points as x1, y1, and x2, y2. And we know that the formula for slope, m, is y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So given these two points, we have y2 13 minus y1, which is 5, over x2, which is 6, minus x1, which is 2. Um, 13 minus 5 is 8, divided by 6 minus 2 is 4, which gives us 2. So our slope is 2, and we can write our equation y equals 2x plus b, which is still unknown. So we can choose either of these pairs. Let's choose the first one, where we let x equal to 2 and y equal to 5. We can plug these two in and solve for b. So we get 5 is equal to 2 times 2 plus b, or 5 is equal to 4 plus b, or subtracting 4 on both sides. We get b is equal to 5 minus 4, which is 1. Thus, our equation of the line is going to be y equals 2x plus 1. OK, let's do one more example. This time, suppose we have the points negative 1, 10, and 2, comma, 12. Again, I'm just going to mark these points as x1, y1, and x2, y2. So again, using our formula for slope, we have y2 minus y1, which is 12 minus 10, over x2 minus x1, which is 2 minus, in parentheses, negative 1. You have to be very careful with the signs. So we have 12 minus 10 over when you have 2 minus negative 1. Whenever you subtract a negative, you flip both to become positive. So this becomes 2 plus 1. So 12 minus 10 is 2 over 2 plus 1 is 3. So our slope is 2 thirds. So we can write our equation y equals 2 thirds x plus b. So now we can choose either of these two points to plug in and solve for b. Let's do the first one. We're going to let x equal negative 1 and y equal 10. Plugging these two points in, we get 10 equals 2 thirds times x is equal to 1 plus b, or 10 is equal to 2 thirds times negative 1 is negative 2 thirds plus b, and then adding 2 thirds on both sides, we get b is equal to 10 plus 2 thirds. And just to add those two, 10 over 1 plus 2 thirds, the least common multiple of 1 and 3 is 3. So here, we want a denominator of 3. So we multiply top and bottom by 3 to get 30 over 3 plus 2 over 3. Now since the denominators are the same, we can keep the denominator, which is 3, and add the numerators to get 32 over 3. 
So b is equal to 32 over 3. Thus, since we have the slope and y-intercept, we can write this line as y equals slope of 2 thirds x plus y-intercept of 32 over 3.